We are George Fisher Piping Systems, and this is Automation Made Easy. Today, we will be demonstrating how to perform initial calibration of a GFPH system using the 9900 transmitter EasyCal function and 2751 smart sensor electronics. For our purposes, a pH system consists of a 272x or 273x pH electrode the 2751 smart sensor electronics, and a 9900 transmitter set to pH sensor measurement type. In addition to your wired and powered pH system, you will need two different pH buffer solutions within the range of your application. We recommend using pH 7 buffer during every calibration. The second buffer can be either pH 4 or pH 10. You will also need a container of clean water, two empty containers for the buffer solutions, a non-abrasive cloth, and a pair of protective gloves. For your convenience, we offer a pH calibration kit, which includes pH 4 and pH 7 buffers, three polypropylene cups, and one cup stand. pH EasyCal Procedure First, we have to access the calibration menu. On the 9900, press and hold the Enter button for 5 seconds. Navigate to the Cal menu and press Enter. The first setting shown must be set to Cal at Instrument. Press the down arrow twice. Press the right once to activate the EasyCal function. You may be required to enter your security code. The factory default is up, 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 down. Place sensor in buffer 1 will flash on the display. Before moving forward, put on your protective gloves. And we need to clean the electrode. Rinse the electrode in the container of clean water and pat dry with the non-abrasive cloth. Being careful not to scratch the glass tip. Submerge the electrode tip in the first pH buffer and press Enter. You may have to wait approximately 30 seconds for the millivolt reading on the 9900 to stabilize. During this time, record the millivolt values. This information is valuable for troubleshooting. Once the millivolt value has stabilized, press Enter to accept it. We have to clean the electrode again before moving on to the next buffer. Place sensor in buffer 2 will flash on the 9900 display. Again, while holding the 2751 sensor electronics, submerge the electrode in the second pH buffer and press Enter. Same as the first time, We'll have to wait approximately 30 seconds for the millivolt values to stabilize. Make sure to record millivolt values. Once the millivolt value has stabilized, press Enter to accept it. We'll have to clean the electrode one last time before placing it into your application or into storage. Pat dry with a non-abrasive cloth. Being careful not to scratch the glass tip. You have successfully completed the pH Easy Cal process. Press up and down arrows at the same time twice to exit the Cal menu and return to View mode. How often to perform calibration? All pH systems require periodic calibration over a regular interval, monitor the electrode's performance throughout its life, and recalibrate at least once per month. For more information about our products, please visit our website.